Tyler Show started originally as sort of a writing exercise between these two guys, Jeff Bowen and Hunter Bell. They were writing partners. And it was really a creative exercise for them to submit material to this inaugural season of this new musical theater festival in New York called the New York Musical Theater Festival. Very quickly they realized the most interesting thing about trying to write a musical in three weeks to submit to a musical theater festival was trying to write a musical in three weeks to submit to a musical theater festival. So they actually started to write about the writing process. Wow, so everything I say from now on could actually be in our show? Yeah. yeah. Like this? Like this. And this? And this. <laughs> This too. This too. <laughs> but the thing about this production that quickly turned the corner was they realized this was something that was not only about the process, it was about the process in real time. And they bounced back and forth in the play between the recognition that what they're executing is a completed piece of theater and the actual act of creating. The actors in our show, what could be better? Sweeter. What? Very quickly I realized because the, the writers were executing the material themselves, they play themselves, they needed an outside eye to be able to help them understand how it was being perceived. And from the very first day we sat down together in the room, I knew that this had the potential to be something much, much bigger than they realized. TV actors in our show, what could be sweet? All the actors in the play are very, very intelligent people and they each utilize it in different ways and they all four have very, very different functions in the play. Heidi is more of a classic musical theater personality and people coming to see a Broadway musical that are accustomed to a certain kind of Broadway musical are relieved when Heidi walks out on stage and opens up her mouth and sings. She has a glorious voice. Susan Blackwell is one of the funniest oddball actresses I've ever met and I personally have a very soft spot for those kinds of character actresses. Cause it's sort of Eve Arden-ish. Those nine people will tell nine people Then we'll have eighteen people loving the show And I think that's one of the secrets of Title of Show is that at some point or another it feels very personal to everyone in the audience. Whatever the, that kernel is that strikes them it feels like they could not, it could not have been written for anyone but them. It speaks to people very personally. And it makes people feel like they could do it. And that's a great thing. Everyone walks away from this play feeling like they can do anything they want to do with their lives. And in fact, they can. <laughs>